Hello guys, welcome back to At All Robotics. In this video, we are going to see how to use ultrasonic sensor with Arduino. So what is ultrasonic sensor? So ultrasonic sensor sends ultrasound to detect object. Well, we have done this with IR sensor also that it detects the object in front of it. But ultrasonic sensor can also detect, uh, tell you the exact distance between an object and the sensor and it uses the ultrasound and calculate the distance using the formula distance is equal to speed by time well i'm not going to explain everything in this video you can go and see the explanation video uh, i have already posted that one year ago and you can get the link um, in description box and in i button with that let's start this video and see the hardware configurations of our ultrasonic sensor let's go so guys this is our ultrasonic sensor and here you can see that its number is HCSR04 in lesson number 10 I have already given you uh, the list and this name was given there so there are four pins in our ultrasonic sensors and these two are ultrasonic sensors so this here you can see that P is written this means this is the transmitter and here R is written means this is the receiver so and there are four pins first one is VCC second one uh, second one is trick pin and third one is eco pin and fourth one is ground pin so VCC is connected to 5 volt of Arduino ground is connected to ground of Arduino and trick and eco pin this pin this both pins are connected to any digital pin of Arduino trick pin uh, means trigger pin like this will trigger the ultrasound means this uh, whenever you will send some digital signal to this trick pin then this transmitter will send the signal and eco pin eco pin uh, will actually this will say if uh, this sends whenever this uh, receiver will receive any uh, ultrasound then this uh, eco pin will say that now uh, why is its name is eco pin i will tell you that so here you can see that so why what happened actually so this transmitter sends the ultrasound and uh, it will just uh, reflect back from the surface of the object and received by receiver now if you go on a mountain and say something then you will hear the echo and same way whenever this uh, ultrasonic sensor sends a uh, ultrasound it receives back like echo that's why it's uh, the pin which receives back the ultrasound is known as echo pin and this is how this happens so here you can see that that ultrasound is actually traveling actual distance two times the actual distance that's why here is the formula that is speed is equal to distance by time so we want distance so we will just do speed into time and actually it's it will be divided by two because the distance here 2d is equal to speed into time so this 2 will come here and at final you will get the time by 58 is equal to distance in centimeter and time by 148 is equal to distances inch this uh, we will use these two lines in our programming okay so if you don't understand this or anything uh, i have already told you that uh, i have given the video link in description as well as in i button so you can check that video i have explained this very well there and then next is our uh, circuit connection so the circuit connection is very simple just i said like vcc is connected to 5 volt ground is connected to ground of arduino and trick pin here trick pin is connected to pin 2 and eco pin is connected to pin number 4 actually you can connect with any digital pin mm, that's not a problem so and guys in this uh, in all the videos whenever i say that uh, you can connect that with uh, digital pin generally i connected with pin 2 3 and 4 because these are the first pins there is no logic behind that why i only connect to this you can connect to anything 8 9 10 any one for me i just go in ascending order that's why i use these pins and uh, you know some people have ocd to uh, arrange everything correctly that's why you can use any pin actually so now let's go and write the program for our this project let's go so guys now we will start the coding part so 
first of all i will write pin mode pin mode two comma just for us wait for a second i am lazy that's why i'm just copy pasting here i will write output and here i will write input and here i will write four now this is the output pin means this is track pin two is connected to track pin and four is connected to echo now i will initialize the serial monitor serial dot begin at 9600 baud rate and here first of all what i will do i will just uh, switch off first i will write digital write two comma low now what it will do it will filter uh, the pin to like um, um, sometime our hardware behaves in a very different way like uh, mysterious way you can say sometime whenever you don't write low it stay high that's why we are saying that please keep the pin to low before anything then uh, then what we will do we will just uh, go for a delay very small delay of 2 milliseconds maybe 4 milliseconds and then we will write digital write pin 2 comma high and at this point what will what will we will see at this point we are just sending ultrasound pin 2 is trick pin and when pin 2 is high it means we are sending the ultrasound and what will we do we will after some time means a very small time like 10 milliseconds what we will do we will just turn it off like we will turn off the pin number 2 to low now what does uh, what it will do now here first of all we are just filtering i can just reduce it more like 2 so first of all we are just turning the pin to low for filtering purpose then we are sending the ultrasound for 10 millisecond and then we are switching it off yeah, then we are not sending it and here what i will do so first of all i need to make some uh, variables so first of int type i will make uh, centimeter and inch as variable as you can see that we will store centimeter value and each value that will be then we will make one more variable and it will be of long time and write it and i will name it as ms milliseconds now let's see what i'm going to do now i'm going to use a new function for the first time so that is ms is equal to pulse in pulse in pin number four comma high now what it will do now this pulse in function is just like a person uh, holding with a stopwatch so it will just count the time for how much time after how much time i am receiving back the ultrasound and with this we know the time of uh, that uh, how much time it will take uh, how much time it is coming back and we already know the speed of ultrasound in air so we get the value or uh, we get the time here actually this will store the time i will write trvl travel time for ultrasound okay and now what here you will do we will simply write i have already told you that uh, for centimeter what we will use and for inch what we are going to use so first i will write centimeter is equal to oh, ms by 58 and inch is equal to ms by 148 now first this will store the value in centimeter and this will store the value in inch and i will now just print it down here what i will do i will just write print okay first i need to write serial dot print i will write uh, the value of centimeter and then i will just copy it and here and i will write print talon centimeter okay and i will just copy it line become now you already know that i'm lazy so here i will write inch and here i will do inch and finally a delay of one of 250 milliseconds no let it let me this a uh, greater one like not 250 is good so i will just make a delay of now i will compile this i will just save it and i will upload it so guys now we have uploaded this now let's see this in action so i will start this uh, serial monitor and just here you will see what we are getting these each are one uh, centimeter square blocks means this is the five centimeter this is 10 
this is 10 and uh, this is 15 okay so now i will just show you that so this is the 10 when i will keep my hand here it, it will uh, right uh, yeah it is saying like 11 and 12 okay so some errors will be there but it's correct almost correct right like i have to keep my hand steady so i think i should use something like this to keep it here okay so now it's saying right now nine centimeters okay it will work i think it will work nine ten eleven right sometime ten sometime eleven and just after one centimeter so you can see that this one is telling the everything correctly so this way this is uh, this way the ultrasonic sensor can tell you the exact distance obviously there will be some uh, errors um, like here we are getting an error of one centimeter so that's it for this video guys so guys signing out see you in the next video with a project please like share and subscribe bye guys